Nick Cordero dead, Broadway star dies from coronavirus complications at 41. Nick Cordero has died after a long battle with coronavirus. According to People, Cordero spent more than 90 days in the hospital. Cordero woke up from his coma in mid-May but took a turn for the worse again May 20. From that point, his progress became stuck in a wait-and-see holding pattern as he remained in the ICU because of how ravaged his lungs were from the virus. Continued treatment included an injection of stem cells administered on June 5, just days after doctors told his wife she should say her goodbyes, in an attempt to reverse some of the lung damage. Cordero, whose Broadway credits include Waitress and Rock of Ages, died on Sunday morning at the Cedars-Sinai Medical Center in Los Angeles, where he had been hospitalized for over 90 days. He is survived by his wife Amanda Klutz, whom he wed in September 2017, and their one-year-old son Elvis Eduardo. God has another angel in heaven now. My darling husband passed away this morning. He was surrounded in love by his family, singing and praying as he gently left this earth. I am in disbelief and hurting everywhere. My heart is broken as I cannot imagine our lives without him. Nick was such a bright light. He was everyone's friend, loved to listen, help and especially talk. He was an incredible actor and musician. He loved his family and loved being a father and husband. Elvis and I will miss him in everything we do, every day, she wrote on Instagram Sunday. May his soul rest in peace.